Hey loves, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I wanted to share all about fall. We're officially fall. The weather is getting colder right now. So what more better way to share a lot of fall pieces that you can wear for whatever occasion it is that you have, something you can wear. Let's say you're going for a date with your friends, date night brunch, lunch, or just want to look cute. Something to just wear that it's easy, fun, and effortless chic. So stay tuned while I will share all those pieces. But before we get started, for those of you who are new, I am Stella. I am a fashion and content lifestyle creator at judo-fashion.com. previously shared about pre fall collection in my previous video so today I wanted to share more for outfit ideas I got a lot of requests saying I should share more different outfits on what to wear for fall so this outfits are different things you could wear um, the weather is not that cold yet so this some outfits you can really pull away with wearing these pieces and these pieces are things like maybe you have from summer you can transition them now to fall and also a lot of these pieces something that you can wear whether you're going on a brunch day a dinner date with your partner hanging out with your friends or just wanted to just step out and look cute this outfit is for you it's fun it's effortless and it's chic of course so before we get started you know where you can find me when I'm not on YouTube you can always 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 find me on Instagram this is my Instagram handle right here and make sure you follow me for tons and tons of fashion lifestyle and beauty con content over there and also you can also find me for full content on my blog right here at your door-fashion.com so before we get started um, throughout the video, you'll see other places that you can find me on my social media. I have Facebook, of course, TikTok, Pinterest, which I'm enjoying pinning a lot of stuff. So anyways, let's get started with what today's video is all about. It's all about fall fashion. And in this outfit for fall fashion, I incorporated a lot of fall trends that if in case you haven't noticed some of these trends one of the biggest trends this fall winter season is vest and i will you'll see how i style vest another thing you get to see is loafers i've always been a huge fan of loafers and you can get to see me style my prada loafers in today's outfit compilations so let's get started let's start with the first look the first look i'm wearing this vegan leather shorts I've had this um, I have the shorts for quite a while I think I got it from Abercrombie and Fitch I think I got it for me I think it's almost three years now it's very soft love the color and I just love how I'm I paired it with a vest this also gives you an idea on how to style vests for fall and how to wear your leather shorts or shorts that you might want to transition from your summer to fall so i layered the vest with a white button down shirt i always have to have white button down shirt i have a ton of it so i layered my vest with a white button down shirt added my brown ysl rider boots love how i'm playing around with the neutral colored I love wearing as much as I love color. I also love wearing neutrals 
colors especially neutral colors for neutral colors i love mixing it back maybe different shades of neutral brown light brown beige mixing everything together so the next look it's a slip dress so one second take a look at it dress i love slip dresses it doesn't have to be this specific slip dress so whatever slip dress that you are wearing whatever slip dress that you like if a way for you to transition your slip dress so in summer you can wear your slip dress without anything because it's warm but by fall you can style it up and still be able to still wear your slip dress so for this look i added a long cardigan cardigans are very huge this fall winter season this getting good i've had it for a while you won't believe it i got it from walmart i'll put all the links in my description I added the, it's kind of like a rustic uh, orange brown color feel to it, but this color, it helps bounce off and contrasts with the slip dress that I'm wearing. So with slip dresses, it's always, I always love mixing one color slip dress and a cardigan that it's slightly a different color to kind of play with the color. So this look, I paired it with boots, uh, I love, I love having some shade of brown boots different shades of brown boots especially for this season so i paired it with knee-high boots i completed uh the look with this pouch bag this ba bag kind of reminds me of the bottega bag but this is definitely the affordable way way affordable version for mango um so this is how you can pair this look this this will make an awesome date night um when you feel gonna date night with your partner this will be awesome so the next look, let's see, the next look is wide leg pants. I am a big, big sucker for wide leg pants. I, whenever I come across wide leg pants, it's almost like I have to have it. This wide leg pants, I bought it last holiday season. It's made by a Nigerian based label. I'll link the below their Instagram handle below and you can check them out and it got here pretty no stress no very easy um, it got here by DHL quick it didn't take too long probably at the most I think it took about a week or less than two weeks to get here so I paired this shirt love the color the color gives me very fall vibes I love the cuff length of the pants gives it very unique feel to it and it's also slightly high waist i paired it with a crop knit top uh, from h&m so you can see how i'm wearing it with the crop knit top without really tucking it in it sits right on the shorts but the next look you can see how i decided to just tuck it in i tucked it in under my bra so that you can see a little bit of the sh the pants and you can still see a little bit of the top so in that way it's not it doesn't look too bulky another way that you can good way to pair this pants with it i'm thinking of let's say like a bralette crop uh, top and then add a blazer i'll also show you right here how i styled it last year so different ways how i styled it so this is another way to dress up your pants and make it fun for fall i completed my look with boots um course you know how much um i love boots especially during winter if you don't want to have a bare your legs boots are always my go-to so whether i'm wearing a dress because some people some people tend to shy away from wearing dress during the winter but you can always wear your dress once you add knee high boots or over knee high boots and that will keep you warm so with those pants i added a brown boots and complete everything so let's go to the next look. The next look is another letter short. I love, I've been loving a lot of letter shorts lately. And you're just definitely gonna be seeing a lot of letter shorts this fall winter. This letter shorts, uh, of course, I also got it a year ago. It's a black letter short. Another way to style letter short like I showed you earlier and this is another way you can also style your letter short. So I paired it with a knit sweater. Knit sweaters with button down in the middle or zip 
is very on trend right now so you're gonna be seeing a lot of people wearing a lot of chunking it to with the zip or chunking it with like two or three buttons right here almost anywhere you look any store you look it's gonna have some form of that style of knit so I paired it with the stripe black and white knit sweater leather shorts my loafers I'm loving this lovers. It's it just makes any look look just so effortless, so chic. And at the same time, if you don't like wearing heels, best bet is try a loafers. You'll love it. So that's how I completed this look with a jumbo, my jumbo Chanel bag. Another way you can see another way I styled it is by also adding my trench coat. I can add my trench coat just to add a little bit of flair and a little bit of contrast to the whole black and white look. So the next look uh, for fall, it's this is like a very fun casual look. Let's say if you're hanging out with your friends or you just wanted to just grab lunch with your friends and you don't want to overdressed at the same time you don't want to look underdressed i don't like i i, I always get that i always overdress the things but this is a good way to look so effortless like you're not trying too hard but you still look pretty cool chic for a brunch with friends i love a distressed denim i feel like this the right distressed denim has a way of just making you just look effortless you agree with me but this I paired it with this Zara padded shirt. Careful with this with this top, it runs small. So depending on how you want to fit, I'll say size up with this top. But I love the shoulder padded top and I love the color and I love the ruching and the top. So this top with the jeans, made it a little high waist, and paired it with my loafers, and you're good to go for your nice brunch without looking like you're over trying too hard to look cool or look good. So this is how I and I completed the look with my with my bag. Love this bag. Linked below. Um, it's a great crossbody bag. It's very it's good enough size that you can just throw on your phone and throw on little things and take it out i love the brand strength berry i hope i pronounced it right so the next look which is the last look is another vest look so when it comes you can tell how much i love wearing vests so this vest look it gives you a more it's more of slightly more formal yet a little bit more sexy feel way of styling a vest so for this vest i can definitely see myself wearing it out for a dinner date or even to just hang out with friends and i, I can see myself wearing this more on uh evening evening time kind of outfit so the vest is by cause i love that it's deep the deep uh, neckline so with the deep neckline I don't bother wearing anything no layer it with any shirt underneath so that the deep neckline gives it this very feminine like sexy feel without over going overboard I paired it with the long length shorts that I got from H&M last holiday season H&M studio collection and there's so many other shorts like this i'll link it below because this one is currently sold out pair that and pair it with a knee-high boots and you would just you can't go wrong with black so this is how i completed the book is black on black on black even though the the vest it's like a navy blue but it's almost like that navy blue that is closer to the black side that completes it for fall looks ideas. Um, I'll also be I'll keep sharing more in the coming videos to come down the line. I'll be sharing different outfits, whether it's for fall, winter, and also different things. So, if you haven't subscribed to my video, don't forget to hit the subscription button, hit the bell button, so that you don't miss any posts. And please, please don't forget to like this video, drop a comment. 
let me know which look it's your favorite look and let me know what else you want to see drop a line give me suggestions i need your suggestions of what to what next i should shoot so thank you for watching hope you love this video until next time have a good day mm -hmm.